back again with another music video reaction. My name is Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. And if you click the thumbnail, you're here to check out some Aurora. Aurora is an artist I was told to check out a little while ago, and I've actually been able to get a good bit of her catalog under my belt and see the vast amount of different types of music and music videos that she makes. I mean, literally, she would be one of those people that uh, I'll talk about that is an artist. Like, you know, it's not just one genre of music or even one medium of just music. I mean, she does music. There's obviously some aesthetic things with the music videos and like interpretive and expressive dance. I mean, it's kind of like all over the place. She's doing a lot of different things and really speaking her mind through her music. And we actually have a brand new one. And I think it's been a little while since we had a brand new one. I reacted to one not that long ago and it was a much different type of song. It was much more almost poppy, I think, than a lot of her previous ones. It got into it a good bit, but it was just a little bit of a shift from some of the other ones that I'd listened to. So I'm curious to see what this one about but this one's called the conflict of the mind that sounds heavy sounds fitting let's go ahead and check it out all right let's do it da, da.
Twilight. So that was Aurora with Conflict of the Mind. And that was... Okay, I got quite a bit of thoughts going through the head here. I mean, firstly, the video is so very simple but very poignant again. It, it She's definitely setting a mood and trying to get the uh, context across and trying to get that figured out. I mean, Conflict of the Mind. I'm not sure if this is actually her remembering back or talking about her being young or like her now or her relationship with her family. Conflict of the mind. And then with some of the imagery of like, you know, just the empty clothing being there, is it not really realizing what you have until it's gone? Hmm. Okay, that's a little deep. Okay, it's deep. I guess I figured that with the conflict of the mind as the title. Okay, let me know a little bit more in the context of that one. Maybe it is more of just finding satisfaction in what you have or being able to express yourself. I don't quite know. I'm gonna have to listen to it a little bit more, but I will also say that how the song actually sounded maybe one of my actual favorite ones of her it was so interesting it was like a weird combination of almost like some old radiohead with uh what's that like icelandic band i can't remember the name of that other band but they sang in hopelandic if i do remember and i absolutely loved a couple of their songs but it was also that very kind of almost angelic or ethereal sound of not necessarily knowing where it's coming from but it all harmonizes so well and their different notes or different words or even some words i don't even know what they're saying but it just sounds so wonderful and beautiful and pleasant even that the context isn't necessarily that happy it's a very interesting song and i definitely i'm gonna have to listen to that one some more but let me know more in the context let me know more in the comment section about what you think the song is about and i think this might be part of a new album she's releasing i don't know let me know in the comment section let me know what you guys thought don't forget like share subscribe go to the subscribe button if you would that'd be fantastic and as always you're awesome peace out